Daily SDRT. Subscribe now. now. Subscribe now. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. And in this video, we'll be talking about Bezo. As you guys should all know, the whole Bezo NBA Young Boy situation going on right now. Birdman's nephew. Um, allegedly, Bezo and Young Boy and his crew got into a situation, altercation, and then that altercation had left Bezo in critical condition in the hospital. Bezo came out the hospital dissing YB and all that. So you guys should know all of that and be all caught up. So that's what we'll be talking about today. And Street Juice TV, you could go follow them on Instagram at Street Juice TV and check out their YouTube. As you guys can see on the screen, this is their YouTube. As you guys, you can see their channel name and also the video. They did a full interview with Bezo, a full 30 minute interview. So if you guys want to go watch that, the link will be in the bio. So go check that out if you guys want to. But that's what we'll be talking about right now. So Bezo set out in their interview how the whole situation with YB actually started a whole a, a couple months ago. He said how Young Boy and his crew and Bezo and some of his people, Bezo wasn't a part of the situation, but Young Boy and his crew got into it with some of Bezo's people, and he felt like Young Boy handled the situation wrong in the wrong way. He said Young Boy should have de-escalated the situation, but he didn't. So after the situation happened, Bezo ends up calling, Bezo ends up FaceTiming YB, and he checks him about it. So he says, that's what he said. He checked, he called YB on face, FaceTime. He checked him about what happened on the situation. And then he continues saying how right is right and wrong is wrong. And how young boy and his crew, young boy's crew is full of all D writers and how all they do is, and all they do is listen to whatever YB says, even though if he could be wrong, they don't let him know that because they just D writers and all that. So he said how the situation between young boy's crew, then he checked YB which led to him like getting beat up by them. So he says how, so that was a couple months ago. So later down the line, he says how Michi and him were supposed to do a f song together. So Michi was in the studio. It was Michi, some other guy he had a problem with and Bezo and his girl. Then all of a sudden Michi was telling him something and then now he's getting beat up in the studio. And then they took him, They he talked about how they tied him up to a chair, put a bag over his head, taped him up to a chair and was beating him up. He said it was like 10, 20 people too. So comment down below what you guys got to think say about that. Bezo said how 10 to 20 people was like beating him up, taped, taped him up to a chair and all that. So, and I also got some clips for y'all. So that's what he said. And he also said, he, he, he also said how the only reason he's still alive is probably because of 3-3. Three, three. NBA OG 33. That's what he had to say. So here are some clips for y'all. And yeah. Right is wrong. Right is right. And wrong is wrong. My so beat me up and snake me because I let him know that he was wrong. That's what that was straight up about. Three to one is the reason why I'm talking to you today, big brother. If it wasn't for three, I would. I probably be dead. I would, I, I'd be. I'd be a G money right now. I'd be one of the we grew up with. Who you people? Who you snake? Honestly, ain't gonna let nobody do three nothing. Which that's the three is the, the reason why I'm still living. That what a lot of people don't know. Man, them dudes called three on. Man, them dudes called three on Facetime and showed them over me. And that dude three times they had tears in his. He begged them dudes that they could go. That three is my partner, bro. For his YB, man, I don't mean that dude don't you know. Me and that dude don't even convert like that. You know what I'm saying? Unless we round each other. Yeah. Once again, this interview is from Street Juice TV. So if you guys want to see the full interview, hit the link in the bio. So yeah, but as you guys heard, he said how if it wasn't for 3-3, he, he probably would have ended up like G-Money. How they FaceTimed 3-3 and 3-3 was like basically crying and said, let him go and begged him, begged them to let him go. He said how YB is mad because he said how YB snaked him because he checked him about what is right and what's wrong. Um, What else did he say? What else? Um... Oh, yeah, he also brought up the fact how he said how him and YB weren't really all that close. He said how three was his boy, three was his brother. So three was his guy, as you guys heard. Him and YB wasn't really all that. He said the only reason he rode for YB the way he did it was because he was so close to three that 
three and introduced YB and Bezo together. So he rode for YB as strong as he would like ride for three off the strength of three. That's what he said in the interview. The only reason he supported and had all this loyalty for YB was off the strength of three because he knows he really cares about three. And if he knows if young boy gets into a situation, three is also going to be going to be in, involved in the situation. So he said off the strength of three and three being my boy and all that, I'm going to ride for YB. But he said I'll, all in all in all, him and YB weren't really all that close. As you guys heard, the only time they really talked was at shows and and when they were in the streets together. But if they weren't together, they hadn't they didn't talk, they didn't communicate. So obviously their relationship wasn't really all that. But uh, yeah. So as you guys heard, that's what Basil had to say. There was a whole lot I mean, there was a whole thirty minute inter interview. There's a whole lot more for you guys to find out. He talked about NBA Michi saying how Michi got beat up also. He said how bro he started talking about Baby Joe, how Baby Joe got into a fight and some guy was beating up Baby Joe. So, yeah. If you guys want to see that whole interview, go check it out. Link in the bio. But comment down below what you guys think. And, yeah. That's pretty much it for this video. Basil, first interview about the whole situation. Let people know what was going on. Talked about YB, 3-3, Baby Joe, and more. So, full interview in the, com in the link. Full interview in the bio, my fault. And, yeah. That's it for this video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and turn on post notifications. Thanks for watching.